Hi, I'm Dr. Stacy Ripke, and for today's Three Minute Mondays, we are at NYU College of Dentistry's Virtual Reality Lab with this incredible team where we are going to learn about the innovative and groundbreaking way that students are learning to administer local anesthesia. Come on, let's go take a look. This is the clinic in oral surgery, except this clinic doesn't exist. It only exists in a virtual world. Today, we're going to teach Dean Ripke how to give her first local anesthesia injection. So here we are, where the magic happens at the VR lab. We have had in the last two years more than 800 students being trained in the technique of local anesthesia here at the VR lab in the DDS program. This simulation system doesn't exist anywhere in the, in the U.S. This is a custom system that we have built with the expertise of faculty and for the benefit of the students. So I had heard about this project, but it wasn't until I walked into an empty room with white walls put on the goggles and suddenly was in an oral surgery treatment room that I really appreciated how incredible and groundbreaking this work really is. I had a sense that I was truly picking up the instruments, that I was moving around the room and interacting with a patient in the chair. It has entirely changed my thinking about the way that we are doing teaching and learning and the opportunities that our students have by being here. I am so excited to see where this goes next and with the new innovations of adding the haptic piece, this will truly change the future of teaching and learning in dentistry. Our work to incorporate haptic technology into the controllers was recognized with a 19 Washington Square North Fellowship. In partnership with Abu Dhabi, we are making advances in how we're using the hands as part of the simulation. As a faculty member, it's really exciting for me to watch students learn on a local anesthesia simulator and then carry those skills into real life. Watching students be more comfortable in the clinic and seeing patients know that as faculty, we're trying to give the best education that we can has been everything, and I think it's really exciting to watch. That was unbelievable. I've never done anything like this, and I can only imagine what it's like to be doing this as part of your training. So what has it been for you? I've gained so much confidence before I was able to administer a nerve block on an actual patient. You can do this an unlimited amount of times, and you can practice even from home. So you really give yourself an opportunity to get more comfortable and to build that muscle memory of lifting a syringe away from your body and without having to practice on a real person. In virtual reality, you can practice as many times as you want. In real life, you only have that one shot. So it's, it's a great way to practice so that when you're in the moment, you don't freeze up. I'm so energized by what I saw and learned here today. And this is only the beginning. This is a project in its first iteration that's going to continue to grow. So I can't wait to come back here next time and learn more. That's it for today's 3 Minute Mondays, and I'll see you next week.